Hello everyone, Nary here from Drake Wing Gamer. Some of you know me on Twitter, The Gaming Dragon. Today, I'm bringing you another bite-sized horror, and we are looking at Dread Delusion, another game that's part of the uh, PS1 uh, horror demo disc. This is apparently a small-scale open-world game. So, let's see... It's always nice to have little effects and such. Alright, so, I really like the appearance of this. This, this looks really nice. Oh, let's jump into this. Uh, this is apparently a game about magic that is controlled by machines, but a dark corruption is rising up. Let's see what that holds in store for us. Slot, okay. All right. All right, what do we have? This looks like I got, it's not a key. I thought that was a key, it's like a terminal. Alright, that's inventory. Might is one, mind is one. There's only two stats, okay. You stand before an avatar of the clockwork god. It makes abysmal sounds as it connects to the network of machines and magic spread throughout the city. You shift uneasily while you wait. You have no idea why you're here. Being called before an avatar in person is rarely a good thing. The mechanical anatomy shudders and grinds for some time, sputtering oil and steam. Abruptly, it stops. Just as you wonder if it's broken, a feather stylus pops out and writes in large, angular letters. You are subject's number- oh my god, I forget what those mean in, Ro in Roman numerals. Okay. Something. Okay. I have no idea what C and L mean. Subject number, blah. Your data requires amending. State your vocation. You clear your throat. Petty enforcer, you read corrupted citizens and the city scribe. You have a literacy permit to fabricate realm-wide propaganda. Requires mental wit. Alright. You explain how you toil in the towers of happiness each day, writing glorious visions of the sacred city in rhyming verse. The best work is sent to the higher-ranking cipher scribes to be, turned in, and up to, to be turned into intoxicating visions and sent abroad. You do not mention how everything you write is a lie, how this city is dying, with more corrupt citizens being dragged to their deaths each day, and you dare not write the truth. The machine scrawls, data amended, you have gained a delusion of mind. A delusion of mind. <laughs> Subject number, okay, you have been selected for the sacramental duty. Your heart lurches as you read the quickly drying ink. You do not know what the sacramental duty is, only that those who are chosen never return. All right. The sacramental duty is as follows, to find the source of the realm's pestilence, which putrefies the soul land, makes rotten the harvest, and to forever bring an end to this corruption. Failure will result, will result in death by incineration. Chances of success are, calculating, none. Ha! May the blessing of the clockwork god be with you. Please exit via the portal. Well... Oh, I love how I'm working for the Mechanicus. Alright. Huh. Ooh, this is cool. This is really cool. Anything I can explore? Yeah, there's something up there. I don't know what... I don't know what that is. <gasps> Ooh, something right here. What is this? This is a spook... What are you? You're just a red floating skeleton. I'm confused. Oh, stamina bar. Ah, this is really cool. I like this. God, stamina really doesn't regenerate quick. Okay. Now this actually somewhat seems like it could be on a PS1. You just have to cull a lot of that geometry and put in a thick fog. Like a security camera. Yep, yeah, that's a camera, all right. What do we have here? Another outcast from the city of shit and steel, no doubt. Tell me, has your god cast you away to die? At least you recognize the absurdity of that damned place. Since your people came and built that abomination, this land has been slowly rotting. So, I'll be keeping my eye on you, outcast. 
All right. What is over here? These red skeletons. Ooh, I like this music. Hey. What's with all the red skeletons roaming about? Alright, what do we have? The town of Hallow. My people were never allowed past its walls. We natives have been here since the world forging, but even as we starved, this town kept us out. And in the end, when its people writhed in strange agonies, they locked it up and discarded the key in that tower up there. That tower up there. Oh, right here. Okay. One second, guys. <laughs> um, this wasn't really much of a walk. You guys could have gotten the key yourself. Yo. Ew. Town quarantine key. Key allowing entry into the town of Hallow. When the corruption reached the town, it was sealed shut and its people left to perish. Well, ain't that special. Divine Order Log. The town of Hallow was lost. Yesterday the screams rising from the streets terrified me, but now this silence is so much worse. Could we have prevented this if we'd punished more insubordination, rewritten more lives with Cypher? Yes, surely. The Clockwork God, in his divine grace, will judge our methods defective. I locked the quarantine door and sealed the last of the men. What more could I do? Hmm. Saving is disabled in this demo. Please exit the portal. Okay. That's really cool. Save portal is really neat. The tower has sustained significant damage. Would you like to engage automatic repairs? Yes. Upgrades are disabled in the demo. Okay. Alright. Ah, oh, man. Ooh. This is a neat game. Well, I got your key. Ooh, what is this? Okay, had to find another way over there. Let's see what's going on down here. Hey, people, what is this? Home spell, return to the caster to hallow, but at the cost of an affliction. With nothing equipped, select control, then hold right mouse button to cast. Your presence here was predicted. Do you seek help with the sacramental duty? Yes. Leave this town. Seek the cipher. Scribe in his tower. Pass the river. He will direct you further. Alright. Man, what is going on in this place? I don't know what the affliction is, but it certainly does... Ah! You pilfered one coin. Wow, I'm definitely rich. Door requires a key. Alright. No. Oh, okay, I can just jump off. Alright. That's pretty cool. Let's see. Oh, hey. How you doing? What is going on? That looks like a tavern, maybe? Hunt for some secrets. A coin! A gold coin! <clears throat> Sorry, but I, I guys, my allergies been acting up. Hope you all are doing well in your self quarantine. <sighs> Everything requires a key. A key, a key, a key. <sighs> oh! A key! 
A fancy looking key which might open an apartment nearby. It was found near a jumble of hastily discarded papers. <clears throat> Alright. Alright, this is not the key to that door. This is the key to the other door. What's up, buddy boy? Wish I had unlimited sprint. One second. <clears throat> Alright, let's see what's up here. A key. I mean, a coin, not a key. Ooh. Potion of health restores health, but not affliction. Set as a selected item with alt and press R to use. Alright. Victor, the divine order has been tipped off about my work. Some drunk fool recited my poem in the tavern, the one which jests that the clockwork god is broken, and an order spy cut out his tongue right there. I heard he's been taken to the tower where they'll rewrite his mind with cipher magic. I've gathered my drafts. I'm going to burn them in an alley. Destroy everything I've ever given you. Destroy this too. And no one destroyed it, so. I'm gonna see what's I'm gonna find out what's going on here. Yeah, this is cool. This lock could be broken. Okay. Gotta find something to break it. A golden potion. What is this? Potion of stamina. Restore stamina to full set as selected item. Okay. There's a key, all right. Oh, hell. Gotta find another way across, then. What is that? No, it looks like another potion of health. Yep. Let's see what's over here real quick. Man, I love the I love the way this game looks and sounds. Great presentation. All right, got another mana potion. I wonder what the hell these things are. <laughs> Alright. Eleventh day of the month of the harvest. The divine order came again today, demanding a yet steeper tithe. We can't afford this. Bribing that official for a literacy permit took the last of our coin. Misha, if you need money, think of Uncle Sagan, who we buried it by the waterfall. Alright. Buried by the waterfall, huh? Alright, Uncle Sagan, what you got for me? Yep, I see something over there. See, now this is how you do a very interesting, mysterious world. <clears throat> Almost ready to start running again, and off we go. An earth jawbone, a jawbone buried in a small mound by a waterfall. Hopefully, whoever this belonged to perished long before this age of decay. What do I need a job? What do I need a jawbone for? God, this music is really well done. Hey, a multi-storied house. Yeah. And I need a key. I 
key, a key, a key is what I need. Oh man, I wonder why there's all these little red tendrils heading into there. Is it going out or heading in? It's going out of, okay. Oh, no, one of them's going into. Okay, never mind. Hey, buddy. A friendly face, thank the clockwork god. I was thrown from my airship. One of those things got on board. I was ordered by its grace, no less, to clear out the brigands and thieves currently squatting in the hallowed town tavern. Pass phrase to the tavern. Apparently, brigands and thieves have taken control of the tavern. They're selling an array of spoils looted from this chaos. Here, our spy found a way in. Kill them, make merry with them, I don't care anymore. I failed. My data will be erased from the esteemed archives. In the end, it was just as its grace predicted. Huh. Alright, so... While I'm out here, I'm just gonna go ahead and do what I need to, then go back in town, I guess. God, those walls look weird. Ooh, yeah, what is going on over there? Oh, that was it! Oh, yeah, they did say something about a time demo. Oh, man! Uh, Alright, guys, that was uh, Dread Delusion from the uh, PS1 Horror Demo Disc. I hope you all enjoyed that. I really did. I want, I want to see more. Mm, Patreon, lovely hell place. Heh. <laughs> But, alright guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and ring that little notification bell. And I love you all. I'll see you in the next video. Stay safe. Bye-bye.